in the days before the rise of the Brodozer. During a time before Monster Jam and its antecedent series codified what a monster truck was, there was a curious, outlandish creation built by an ingenious Missourian by the name of Bob Chandler. A 1974 Ford F-250 with an extreme lift and ginormous tires, it was, of course, Bigfoot and the Legion of Dorky. Beakroomed trucks with 50 caliber lug nuts and stretched tires littering the area in front of the Las Vegas Convention Center this week during the 2017 SEMA show owed a great debt. Ford F-250 Bigfoot Chandler had been futzing with his truck for the better part of a decade, gradually adding larger tires, higher lifts, and four-wheel steering to his growing behemoth. Bigfoot and its friendly rival, Ever Jassimer's USA-1, were featured in the 1981 comedy Take This Job and Shove It, then play school went and burn the truck into the minds of school children in 1983, building a tough little battery-powered plastic toy that allowed a kid to learn about the wonders of trans for cases by slamming shift levers that protruded through the pickup's roof. A succession of trucks followed, perhaps most notably Bigfoot 5, which wore a set of 10-foot-tall Firestone Tundra tires, taking the aesthetic to its extreme. Ford F-250 Bigfoot but the original truck is still the touchstone. And when we caught a friend on Facebook pledging reverent fealty to one of its meaty Firestones, we made it a mission to track down the mythic beast and bask in its glory. We found it in the Headman Headers booth, and to our delight, it wasn't over-polished and painstakingly restored. The paint on the famous flip-up front clip's hood is oxidized. There are rust spots where the paint has been chipped away. Pinstriping on the frame is scuffed, scratched, and worn. It's an artifact of the 1970s and 1980s, an important one to boot, and it wears its history proudly.